I think vegan gains should stop debating ethics. This is a word. This is a word. This is a word. Hey y'all, welcome to another like quick three minute check-in. So I've been thinking recently, you know, I've been studying economics. I've been also doing this study group around pedagogy of the oppressed. And I've just been thinking about like the difference between where people tend to sit with their ethic, ethics, at least in conversations around ethics, and the way people actually make decisions. So first of all, I think about uh, this one debating tactic that is often used in debates um, with folks like Vegan Gaines and others where they talk about, you know, the qualities that humans have that if they lacked it or a quality that an animal might lack that a human has, that if a human lacked that same quality, we would, you know, eat them or kill them, right? And so, you know, often that leaves people with, you know, of course, nobody's going to say, well, I would kill a human being for that. But the fact of the matter is we live in a society where we choose to kill humans all the time, right? Uh, we have a death penalty, we have police officers that shoot people, and we come up with justifications for the murder of human beings when we find that it's ex expedient, right? When it, when it provides us with the type of a world, the type of safety, the type of comfort that we want, right? So there's not very much of a difference between saying that, you know, I'm going to eat this animal because it's expedient, it's what's convenient for me right now, and the fact that, well, yes, we should have a the death penalty or yes it's right for a police officer to shoot someone that they see as dangerous right so there's it's a very it gets into a very fine line and you know the fact of the matter is people tend to make decisions on the margins right they make marginal decisions based on what is the most convenient and the most practic the most practicable for them in the moment. So even if we're having a discussion about ethics, that doesn't necessarily mean that the person is going to make a change or make a significantly different decision when it comes to the reality of their lives. So yeah, so I really do think that you know, it becomes really foolish. And I think it's super, super foolish when the folks who are, you know, debating ethics are people who behave, you know, as far as I'm concerned, unethically, right? They may, they they present themselves, they, they use, they deploy themselves through violence, right? They make fun of people, you know, they talk about my big head, right? They call me retarded, right? And these are all things that if you think about it, are ways to mark me as an individual that's not worthy to live. So, <laughs> so I'm lacking qualities that make it like, a, a, I, I would say if you, you know, ask them in a pinch and there's evidence of it on my, uh, in the comment section of my website, that there are plenty of people who have told me to kill myself, that I should die, that I'm a cancer, right? That I, I, I don't deserve to live. So this whole idea of presenting an ethical debate for why people should or should not be vegans is one that I think um, a lot of vegans should give up in terms of their trying to convert people. That's three minutes and that's it for this video. Like it if you like it, share, comment, subscribe. This is Reg signing off. Love yourself. Peace. And I love myself.